Always dangerous at this level. Skydancer Hanover uncorked a wild third quarter, but tired late a week ago. Live Out Loud was scratched. They're off. Life Source out of there. Sky Dancer Hanover now sticks a neck in front. Life Source and Sky Dancer Hanover going out there with Canyon Wind. An early skirmish here, three wide around the first turn. Brennan has Life Source wound up early, taking over. Dubé with Sky Dancer Hanover up on the outside now, brushes to the top. Canyon Wind is third. Quick early pace here, two and a half lengths to Cunning Liar in the fourth position, followed by Eaton Roadkill. And then it's Sagebrush and the Globe. Opening quarter four, Sky Dancer Hanover, 26 seconds flat. So Dubé taps the brakes with Sky Dancer. Sky Dancer Hanover, two and a half length lead here on Life Source as they continue up the backside. Canyon Wind under a tight rein third there with Miller. And Cunning Liar bides his time fourth, filling that gap there. Eaton Road Kill under some whip taps fifth, followed by Sagebrush and uh, the Globe. Over at the half miles, Sky Dancer Hanover waltzing along up front here, hits the half in 53 and four fifths. Hot, hot pace here, 27-4 in that second marker. A bit of a breather there. Sky Dancer, Hanover now, jammed up in the pocket. Life Source, first over. Here comes Canyon Wind, attacking now with Miller. A bold challenge comes from Canyon Wind, taking it to Sky Dancer, Hanover, as Dubé steps on the gas again. Life Source locked in the box now with Cunning Liar, fourth on the outside, but under urging and gapping his cover. Then it's the Globe on the inside, fifth with no racing room. Eaton Roadkill and trying to rally from the back is Sage Brush has five and a half to make up but he's rolling one 21 and three and sky dancer hanover is all through now and canyon wind now vaults to the front it's canyon wind but miller's all over him life source on the inside all out and from the back here comes sagebrush on the outside and pierce has him looking to rally past life source explodes on the rail sagebrush on the outside sagebrush over life source eaton roadkill third one 49. How fitting that on Four Leaf Clover night here that the horse who won last year's Four Leaf Clover final, Ron Pierce and Sagebrush, roll by here in the final strides and 149, a March best here, just got the best of life source who had one race in 28 days. How amazing is that guy? Well, Pierce has been driving like a man possessed. Holly, the defending champ, had a hat trick last night, a Grand Slam Thursday. Believe it or not, he's tied Brian Sears for the top spot in the standings with this victory, erasing a 10-win deficit in just one week.